we have a function z equals f of x times y, and we're going to find two things. We're going to find the partial of z with respect to x, and we're going to find the partial of z with respect to y. Okay, so when we're finding the partial of z with respect to x, we have to keep in mind that all of the other variables are constants. So in this case, our y is a constant. All right, so we're going to use the chain rule. So it'll be the derivative of the outside, which is f, evaluated at the inside. So we leave the x times y alone. And then times the derivative of the inside with respect to x. So the y is a constant. The derivative of x is 1. So we just get 1 times y. So we just get y f prime of x, y. Again, we took the derivative of the outside, we left the inside untouched, and then multiply by the derivative of the inside. The derivative of x is 1, the y is a constant, so it just remains, so you just get this. Let's do it here now with y. Same thing, except now all of the x's are constants. So again, we use the chain rule, which says you take the derivative of the outside, and you leave it evaluated at the inside, and then you multiply by the derivative of the inside. This is our inside. So the derivative of y is 1, and the x hangs out. So we just get this. This ends up being x times f prime of xy. Very careful uh, problem, but not so hard once you understand it. I hope this video has been helpful. Good luck.